I went from bride to cried, cried, cried. My name is Jackie Pilisoff, and several years ago, I went through a divorce. It was devastating. It felt hopeless. It felt depressing. It was sad. I felt like I was on an island. And my married friends, I know they love me, but they just didn't understand what I was going through. At the time, I had two toddlers. I didn't have any family in the town where I lived, and I didn't know one divorced person. That was my motivation to start Divorced Girl Smiling, my well-known brand and community. I'm a former TV journalist and Chicago Tribune syndicated columnist who took my pain and turned it into a major brand to help others. What is Divorced Girl Smiling? Divorced Girl Smiling is a place for people facing divorce to connect with vetted, trusted divorce professionals. When I say divorce professionals, I'm talking about divorce attorneys, financial advisors, mediators, mortgage lenders, real estate agents, divorce coaches, therapists, and more. In a divorce, if you want a good outcome, it is so, so important to connect yourself with good divorce professionals who are trustworthy, smart, compassionate, and vetted. Every Divorced Girl Smiling trusted professional is someone I would do business with myself or someone who I already do business with. Divorced Girl Smiling is also a website with thousands of articles on every topic you could imagine having to do with dating and divorce. And it's a podcast and it's a mobile app. Also, want a free consultation? Go to Divorce Girl Smiling and sign up. I want to leave you with a snippet of one of the articles that is typical on Divorce Girl Smiling. It's called Nine Tips to Surviving Divorce. Okay, ready? Number one, allow yourself to grieve. Number two, talk to God because he is listening. Number three, Create a community in your town of divorced people. Make an effort to meet other divorced people because you really will enjoy them and get a lot of satisfaction out of feeling heard and listening to their stories too. Number four, stop looking back. Take coulda, woulda, shoulda out of your vocabulary completely. Number six, focus on your passion because your divorce is gonna be a tough year for you. And if you have something that you're passionate about, it will really take your mind off of things. Number seven, eat well, work out, and minimize alcohol. Number eight, remember that you can't control your ex-husband or your ex-wife. You can only control yourself. And number nine, last but not least, Remember to smile and laugh every day because then you will end up being a divorce girl smiling. If you want to find or be connected with my vetted, trusted divorce professionals, or if you want to read articles or listen to the podcast, come see me at divorcedgirlsmiling.com.